Things are happening. Oh yeah. Hey guys, what's up? Today I am painting the molding in the bedroom that I am currently redoing. This is the master bedroom and when you walked in previously, the bed had been like right over here and then all I did so far was paint. Um, I painted the entire ceiling too, which actually like really hurt my neck. I was standing on this like uh, bench and this little stool thing and I painted the entire ceiling myself. I painted this entire room by myself. I didn't paint the inside of the closet and I feel like I should, but I didn't. I don't know if I need to just because it is white and it's like fine, but like it's not like a fresh coat of paint, you know what I mean? So what I'm doing right now is that I am painting the molding completely white. Noise. I just painted the molding for the windows and the doors. I removed the door of the closet and I'm actually just gonna put up a curtain that I bought from Urban Outfitters. It's coming along very nicely. The only thing is that I just need to do a little like touch up paint work just because when I was painting, I like kind of like got it on the wall. And the color that I used for the wall is called Bistro White. And then the color that I used for this one, I used Valspar Signature Satin Interior. This is what I used. Oh, you can't really see it because I got paint all over it. Meh. Okay, I think there's another bucket somewhere. I didn't get it all over this. Nope, you can't see what I used for the walls. But it is Bistro White, and I think it came out really, really well. Like, honestly, I thought that the color was more similar to white. But then when I painted this actually white, the Bistro white, it comes out like a little bit darker, which I'm very, very happy about because I didn't want it to be like super crazy white. So now that I'm done painting and doing all the molding, I am going to tear the carpet up because there's a nice hardwood floor right underneath it, as you can see in the closet. And I'm really excited to see what it looks like when I take the whole thing out. So that's what I'm about to do now. <laughs> Okay, and then what? That's it. Well, now what do I do? Here. Oh, you gotta pick this stuff up and put it in the garbage bag. Okay. Whoa. 
Here it is, the room. The floor looks really nice. And it feels nice. It looks red on camera though. Like, is it tinted red? I'm not sure. It doesn't look tinted red like in person, but right now I am about to vacuum all of this stuff up. And then I'm gonna take out these staples out of the floor. Also remove all of these like wood pieces on the side. I want to get a close-up of a nail coming out. Are you ready? Yeah. Cinematographer over here. So you're going to slow it up? Am I going to do what? Sure, if that's what you, that's what you uh, think I should do. <laughs> Slow-mo. Recording and doing work at the same time. Crazy. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful shot I'm gonna get. <laughs> Alexa, play Spotify. Alexa, um, Alexa, 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 stop. Alexa, Alexa, play Spotify. Alexa, what's the fun? And there's a lot of random tasks like taking out the door hinges and taking out these little I don't even know what you call this like door frame thing that take a lot of little extra time Aren't we? 
I don't want to put my thing on. <laughs> I don't like that thing. Now we have a blank floor. Here we are, we got our floor. I'm gonna go over it with this stuff. Mineral spirits, y'all. Ew, oh my God, this floor is like actually dirty. I thought these floors weren't as bad as they are, but like my knees are covered in dust and so are my um my feet. And this thing is kind of like nasty. Ew. My work is done here. Kind of. I don't know what they say to do after that. I'm gonna have to rewatch the video because I'm basically like doing this entire thing based on a video that Lowe's posted. So for all I know is they could have just like been telling you to do all this stuff because they want to sell these products and you don't actually need to use all of it, but I bought it and I did it. I just rewatched that video from Lowe's and now I realize why my rag was so dirty when applying the mineral spirits. After sanding, vacuum thoroughly with a brush attachment. Also use a damp mop on the floor to pick up any remaining particles. Uh, so I just completely skipped two very important steps. It's fine. Whatever. I'm going to finish these floors and end this video here. Part two is coming very soon where you will see the final product. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and you're so excited to see part two to see the final product. Thanks for watching and I will see you guys next time. Just a little update. <laughs> you didn't get rid of that paint yet? I did. Oh, okay. I just wanted to show you guys what I'm doing. It wasn't even recording. I don't know. I don't know.